What up, Tyler here, and I am excited. You can tell from the volume of my voice. I'm sorry, I'll tone it down a bit, but I am excited because I'm starting a new series here, and I would love to get your opinions on whether or not it's good or if it's trash, and let me know in the comments. Okay, so this series is gonna be where I read a quote and then give you my thoughts on it. And the thought would be that not only do I give my thoughts, but you guys give your thoughts on it because there are gonna be different perspectives that you have that I might not recognize or experiences you have that could relate to that quote. And so uh, I thought, you know, I thought to myself, Tyler, you can't have a new series unless you come up with a catchy name. And guess what? I've got it. You ready for this? I don't think you're ready. Bump that jelly. Here we go. I'm sorry, I can't shake the table. It is called Rock the Quote. No? You don't wanna, if you wanna applause, you can just to yourself. I don't want you to miss anything on the video. Just spider clap, remember spider clap? Teachers didn't like noise. If you need spider clap. No, I used to make my students, I'd be like, go insane, yell for that kid. They did something good. Okay, so um, I thought I would use, I use the Michael Hyatt planner. I don't know if you guys use this. It's phenomenal. It's like a 90 day planner and it's, it's great for planning stuff out. And uh, well, that's what planners do. Uh, so at the top, they have quotes, and I thought I would kind of start there on some quotes. And if I thought of any others or from the books we're doing with Tarver Book Club, I could throw in those quotes. But I figured I'd start here, and uh, because he's got some really good ones about productivity, um, attitude, things like that. So and uh, the this is this is crazy. So the day I thought of this idea. Um, I was like, you know what? I could just use the quotes from the top of my Michael Hyatt, that's a dude, uh, planner. The quote of the day was actually by Michael Hyatt. So there we go. I'm going to um, leave that to, uh, to a higher power. Okay, so here we go. This is from Michael Hyatt. He said, you attain happiness by making significant progress towards meaningful goals. I'm going to say it again. You attain happiness by making significant progress toward attaining goals. I think that um, for everybody, happiness looks different. Um, you know, and there's a difference between happiness and joy. Um, we can get into that, but I think with regards to this quote, I love that he talks about, he's not specific, but he says meaningful goals. And I think that's, that's the amount of happiness we have is different and what gets to that, like travels down that maze to get to happiness is different for all of us because we all have different passions. And so I think, for me, a meaningful goal for me might be different than a meaningful goal for you or or my um, you know my wife or my kids or my friends or anybody else. Your meaningful goals are going to be different because you have different things that um, give you purpose and give you um, and give you passion in what you're doing. And so um, we can get deeper on this, but I'd love to know your thoughts. What do you think about this? I'll say it one more time. It says you attain happiness by making significant progress towards meaning. Full goals. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to the first ever, to first ever episode of Rock the Quote. Yeah, still pretty proud of that. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you guys. Thanks, Michael Hyatt, for the quote. And uh, you guys stay sweet. Let me know in the comments what you think and never stop learning. Peace.